Hey guys, Greg Thomas here with the Musky Hunter Magazine Challenge. Today's challenge is shallow diving crankbait, but with a twist. I have to add a blade, a little blade, to my shallow diving crankbait. Some way I have to incorporate a blade. Now it can be on the bait or it can be on the leader. Now, nothing about the challenge said this blade had to spin. It was just I had to add a blade to the lure. So this should be pretty interesting. So remember, I've got one day, one bait, one lake. Guys, I better get ready and get some baits to go. We got there, Vic. Don't know. It's gonna be one of your famous catfish. <laughs> Good thing. I don't think so, but. I don't know. I seen white. Oh yeah. That's a musky. Ah, come on. Red snoop. Red snoop. Ha ha ha! Awesome. All right, guys, we just pulled up here, put the Wiley out there, got the blade in the Wiley, and the challenge accepted and accomplished. Let's get this guy off here. Nice. All right, guys, we caught that fish on a shallow dive in Wiley. This is a five and a half inch uh, Wiley. And what I did is I added a blade to it. Here's how you can add blades to crankbait and you get more flash and it really doesn't hurt the action. What I do is on a three hook crankbait like this, I take and I, the middle hook, I actually remove it. Now on Wiley's, there's no uh, split rings on the middle part of the body. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up this middle eyelet right here and I'm gonna pop this hook off and then I've got a number five oh, in Indiana blade. And what this does is I can put it on there. You want to put it to where the cup of the blade is actually going against the body of the bait. Then I just take another pair of pliers here and I'm going to close it like that. Turn it, screw it back in a little bit. And now as this bait goes through the water, this blade's gonna catch the sun, it's gonna catch more flash, and give your bait just a little better look in the water. So, stay with us guys, we're gonna troll some more around here with some of these other blade techniques, and hopefully catch some fish.
No, that was on the spinner leader. Oh yeah, there he is. Not a monster, but a musky. Guys, yeah, I'll tell you what we got here is we got a nice fish. This one actually hit one of the lunge and lures uh, rattling shafts, is what this one grabbed. And what I was doing with these rattle baits, again, a shallow running crankbait, what I was doing with the blade on these is I actually made some leaders. Okay? And I put the blade on the leader, so you have the blade spinning and the trap running behind it, so you're getting flash and vibration from this blade. This is just a number five Indiana that I've got on here, or number five Willow, excuse me, on a solid wire leader. It's not that long, but uh, this little blade on here gives it vibration, and it turns in front of that bait, so it's going to get lift, vibration, uh, and flash. So it's good enough to get this fish in the boat. It's been a tough day. Post cold front, we got two fish answering the call of the challenge of crankbait, shallow running crankbait, and blade. Hey guys, well, you know what? We had a good day out there today. We got two fish on shallow running crankbaits both by incorporating a blade. You know, it wasn't the easiest challenge, but you know what, I learned a few things. I also got to show you what a couple of little tweaks can do to a lure to make it better. So make sure you tune in next week for our next challenge. I don't know what it's gonna be yet. I really like the comments and stuff that I'm getting. I'm picking some of them, trying to figure out how I'm gonna do them. And uh, yeah, it should be pretty uh, pretty cool. So like us on Facebook and Instagram, at Musky Hunter Magazine. Also subscribe to the channel and in the comments, please, please, please give me some more uh, ideas on what I can go out there and do. Challenge me to more stuff. You can also do anything random. I don't care. I, I, I love it all. So give me some challenges. Also, think about subscribing to the Muskie Road Rules podcast on iTunes. Um, we have a lot of fun doing that every week as well. So talk to you later, guys, and stay safe. Mm -hmm.